led a team to an NCAA championship and an NBA title, and Larry Brown right now is in the best position, be it tall or tail. He's got to win this series, win the next series. Bernie Fryer and Ronnie Nunn are the officials. Antonio Davis, this is the first shot of the game, and it's tipped up and in. 11 to nothing on Wednesday night are off to a better start, but Allen Iverson erases that lead. Both guys can shoot a high percentage, and that's Oakley and Williams. Iverson drawing the foul. He has no fear. He just found such a nice, easy flow about it. He stayed in his mid-range game as well as the deep game. Carter defending against McKee. And McKee driving in, changing hands. Game one when he had 17. And the Raptors by three, and Vince Carter! Remember, Vince Carter in game three had nine three-pointers to set an NBA playoff record. They once again, Dick. Then the man playing Carter must come over the top and force him to put the ball down and chase him into a trap. And a very impressive effort. And uh, every time the Raptors and Hill gave it, but could not get back to Oakley. Iverson from the baseline. Matumbo keeps it alive to his seventh game in Philadelphia Sunday. Foul is on Carter, and that's his second personal. So concern there. And a lot of times, star players in this league can do. Makes the catch, keeps it in play, falls away. Ah! The Sixers with the fast break. Iverson. And they're going to call the charge on Allen Iverson as he rammed in to Morris Peterson. Strong in this series, but has gone downhill as the shot has been a little tight. Iverson's three-point attempt over the top as the Raptors shooting 56%. Sixers trailing by 10 points in the game. Toronto has Carter on the bench now with five points and two personal fouls Wednesday. And Iverson with the fall away. He'll play within the offense. He's not going to force anything. And Iverson uh, running uh, into the lane. In this playoff series, 10 times a game. Allen Iverson tonight has scored six points on two for seven shooting. Plus during the timeout, he'll be back at the beginning of the quarter. Carter is back, missed the three. Matumbo gets the rebound as the horn sounds. But the Toronto Raptors making inroads. Cut in half in points and virtually the same in shooting as Allen Iverson coming out having scored six points and Peterson the picking it up it'll be his first anytime that you come out of a huddle comes back and responds here is Vince Carter with a two-point basket struggling with the shot right now only 37 percent Carter off the screen yeah. hitting again he's in rhythm from that side ten point lead for the Toronto Raptors with two minutes gone by here in the second quarter and Iverson Inside, trying to get a foul or a basket, and yeah. Ronnie Nunn blows the whistle. Yeah, I Iverson was really hot. See, he thought he got mugged on the play. The whistle was late, no doubt about it. Davis knocked away, picking up the loose ball, and Carter off the glass with 11 points. 844 remaining in the second quarter. So Vince Carter trying to respond to Allen Iverson's 52 has 11 points in the game at all six of the Raptors point. With 11 minutes to go in the game, your job is to go in the game when the coach starts to you. Carter coming back with a three. And now they signal a two-point basket. But Carter with 14 points in the game. And the tumble and Oakley got to separate some of the players. Well, Snow is upset because he thought that when he called timeout, a three-pointer by Vince Carter, he's got 14 points, and another hot, and Allen Iverson on the other hand, and remember, he sprained a thumb, but it was his left hand in the last game, is two for 10 in the game, and Allen Iverson with six. We only have seven minutes left assists in the league, and they've been able to get the assist. Uh-oh, watch out here. pass, and... The key tried to foul Carter and could not. Yeah, I'm glad that was a no call. Uh, I'm glad they let it go and let him go all the way and uh, excite the crowd, dunk it through. They deserve it. They're, they're playing the passing lane so well. Carter has 11 of his 16. Every time that he's going for a shot attempt, he's leaning, and he's leaning deep, and the angle of the shot. 
with two threes and a much better performance as you look at the comparison of the two prolific scorers. On the tip ball, three on two, Iverson with the finger roll. Approaching the two-minute mark here in the half. Oh, yes! Carter with a two, has 18 points. Both ends of the court. So the two personals by Carter not to factor, and once again a mess up on the perimeter as you've missed at least four driving layups that were contested. They were not, you know, easy layups. Sixers to get two before Toronto has ten and a half seconds themselves. Or you can get something here. Jermaine Jones, time to fire. It'll count if it goes. And it almost did, but the Toronto Raptors. Iverson has not scored in the last 13 and a half minutes, so it's been a quiet time for him as Vince Carter so far has had Allen Iverson looking to get on track with only six points. It's been Vince Carter with a terrific first half of 18 points. You see those three nice green spots? That's off of that down screen. On the left of the lane, you like the fact that he's going strong to the basket. Must get them out of this. Well, it's a 13-point game now. Carter on the runner hits. Vince Carter, he's hit three threes tonight. Allen Iverson still coming up empty by Aaron McKee. And Iverson driving in is fouled. It has been a long while since he has scored. They're going to double-team him. As soon as he puts the ball on the floor, it will come from the closest man on the court. Nick because of either missed shots or quick turnovers. Here's Iverson for three, and he's got it. So Allen Iverson. So the timeout called by Lenny Wilkins spinning is Carter against Matumba. Vince Carter, here is Iverson on the run from the key, and Iverson starting to get it going, now has 13 points. Carter comes up empty on the three, Iverson pushing, going for another three, and this is way off the mark. Ten point lead, and Philadelphia can cut it to single digits. Iverson and Williams scrapping, and the Sixers making a run. Here in this third quarter, they were leading chance to rotate. And this crowd a little anxious now as Carter puts it up. Now there's your movement out. Oh. Steal by Carter. Iverson. And Carter knocks it away. Five on the shot clock. And Iverson went up. And the foul is called against Childs. So instead of the held ball or the uh, 325 remaining in the third, Rodney Buford is coming to the game for the 76ers. Snow running it out, leaving Iverson open for the three. Williams tips it to Oakley. Buford on the foul before the shot. Two minutes to go in the third quarter. Carter. Acrobatic move. Sixers with a tremendous poise here in the third. Carter off balance. Davis with the follow. And the rebound by Hill as time runs out. So the Toronto Raptors held to only three points. No field goals in the last six minutes. You set up, and now they come down the floor. Vince Carter. And Carter hitting a two. Carter now. say it is a three-point basket four of seven from three and Iverson on the drive because of the great range that he possesses he just takes that dribble step back knowing his strength in this series step out and look for that 15 footer Iverson with the runner and Davis gets the rebound here's Peterson this not this time as it scrapes the front of the rim good call and uh, the holding foul He's giving you 17 points and 12 points. Here is the partner with the drive. Trail by nine. Iverson looking for the steal. Peterson looking for Carter posting up against the team. How quick was that? Wow, that's there. Anytime they want a basket. 32 points for Vince Carter. Iverson in the lane, rebound. And the Raptors have certainly settled. And the fans back into this game. Here is Carter. Raptors can sense sending this series to a game seven. Carter hits the three. To do it, and the Raptors confident on the road themselves. Carter changed hands and banked it in.
the biggest lead of the game right now. So here are the 76ers giving the Raptors a scare in the third quarter. And now Toronto has its biggest lead of the game of 20. And then the rest of the fellas feed off of that energy and everybody gets into the movement. No basket and the foul. And Vince Carter going out of the game. Five rebounds, five assists, and 50% from three. Explode. You want it to happen every single night at playoff time. And made the shot look very easy. But that's why he has... In the Eastern Finals, and now up against it. Coaches, players talking maybe too much. It doesn't matter. They are resilient enough to come back and play hard and win. Excellent point, Dick. You're just happy for the franchise. You're happy for the city. You're happy for all the fans who are in here this evening.